If, on the basis of feeding probes, the aphid has recognized the plant as a suitable host, it typically moves to the underside of the leaf in order to start prolonged feeding. During feeding, the aphid stylet bundle reaches the sieve tubes in which the beet mild yellowing virus is transported in the infected plants. The virus particles are passed through the aphid's food canal along with the sap taken up while sucking upside down into the esophagus, the stomach, and the gut. The virus particles cross the lining of the midgut and in this way enter the aphid's body fluid, its hemolymph. The virus particles circulate in the body cavity without multiplying. On their way, they also reach the principal salivary glands and the neighboring accessory salivary glands through which they enter. These viriliferous aphids transmit the beet mild yellowing virus from plant to plant along with salivary secretions. The aphid often remains a virus vector for life. For this reason, this type of virus transmission is termed persistent.